Hey, what's going on guys? Jake the Happy Snake here, and welcome to part 58 of Pokemon Emerald. Last time, I got things started here at Victory Road by battling all the trainers in the first room here, and this time, I am going to be finishing up Victory Road. Now, I didn't really do too much in the last video, because like I said, all I did was just battle all the trainers in the first room, uh, but there is a lot left to do. Like, there's probably another 75% of the cave left to do, so I'm going to be covering that in this video. And starting with the next room here, okay, you are going to want to, to have Flash with you. Because if you go in the next room here, as you can see, you can barely see anything. Because like I said, you're going to want you're gonna want Flash. However, you don't actually need Flash to get through this place. Uh, it, it is actually doable to get through here without Flash. And I am going to be proving that in this video, okay? I am going to be getting through this place without Flash because I have done it enough times in the past that I can actually do it pretty easily. But it, it is pretty difficult. You're, I mean, if you're new to this, I would definitely recommend using Flash, but I just don't really want to have... Like, I already have an HM slave in my party. I don't really want to have a second one. So, yeah, that's kind of my reasoning for that. Plus, like I said, I know how to get through here without using it. So, yeah. But anyways, I am going to, um, yeah, I'm, re re I'm really going to try my best to concentrate because I don't want to screw anything up. And you always want to make sure that you have um, your, your team set up with what Pokemon you want to send out first. Because since you can't really see what you're doing, uh, trainers just kind of pop out of nowhere. So yeah. But anyways, um, so yeah. Uh, yeah, you can, you can use this as a guide too if you want to get through this place without using Flash. You can use this as a guide. Hopefully I don't get too mixed up though. Uh, so I believe we're gonna break this. And guys, I'm gonna be honest, it has been a very, very long time since I've actually gone through this since I've actually gone through this place with using Flash. Um, it's been at least five years. I'm not even joking. Like I, every time I play this game now, when I go through Victory Road, I just never use it because I know I know how to get I know how to get through it. Um, but, uh, yeah, it's been quite a while since I've actually used Flash in this place. Let's go with the Giga Drain. And, uh, yes, since I, ha since I need uh, Bertha in my party, I, uh, Nightmare, I put Nightmare on my PC at the end of the last video. Um, which... I mean, is that a huge deal? But I will have to get him caught up in levels um, before we get to the Elite Four. And maybe I should have used Giga. Yeah, I should. Whatever. I really want to waste PP. So, guys, I have a brand new Let's Play starting tomorrow. It is Super Mario Bros. Deluxe. I already posted my announcement video yesterday, but uh, yeah, I'm very, really, really excited for that. I've already, I've already recorded the first part of that. So that's exciting, and yeah, it's gonna feature a, it's gonna feature a face cam, which is really really awesome. So yeah, I'm really really excited for that. Your relationship is based on solid trust. Whatever you say, dearie. Okay, moving on. No, don't do that. No, no, no. Okay, uh, I don't really know why I'm breaking this because um, I don't really think I need to. Um, crap, yeah. That ledge is it's pretty easy to <laughs> it's pretty easy to uh, fall down there. Uh, we get see the thing, that's exactly what I mean. You can't see the trainers if they're far away, so you don't know if you're getting into a battle. So you if you're if you are trying to get through this place without using Flash, you're gonna want to make sure that, sure that you have the Pokemon in front that you want to use. Now I actually forgot this guy started off with the Swallow, so that was pretty stupid. Um, so we're gonna go over to Voltster. That would have been smart if I had stayed. That would have been good for you if I would stayed in, but unfortunately for you, I didn't stay in. So ha! So there we go. And Mawile is next. So let's go over to my laptop. Mawile is a very weird Pokemon. This is the first thing we see with Mawile in this Let's Play. I'm pretty, sh I'm pretty sure it is. It's a very strange Pokemon. It's just this 
cute little weird thing. Like, like, like this cute little monster. And then it's got this giant mouth. Like, it's really, really weird. Um, anyways, Cadaver's next. Unfortunately, I don't have my dark type with me. So, I'm gonna go over to Emily. And yeah, guys! Pokemon Let's Go Pikachu and Eevee release one week from today, which is so awesome. I am really, really excited, excited about that. Um... That's yeah. I'm really looking forward to that game. I really don't know what to expect. All I know is that it's it's a it's a Kanto game, which is awesome. I'm not a big fan of Kanto, but I mean, I, I you know it's it, it's the original region. I mean, you know, it's it's it. They should have more games of Kanto to be to be perfectly honest. That was a waste of a Dragon Claw, but. I don't really know. I guess I could have used Fly, but that would have wasted two turns. And with that, Emily gets level 52, which is nice. Couldn't do a thing. Oh, actually, you could have. You could have caught more Pokemon. Oh, well, actually, he had three, didn't he? So that, never mind. Uh, okay. Now. Um, let's see. This leads up here. Okay, I want to be very careful what I'm doing. Um, okay, shoot. I don't want to make a mistake. Okay. Okay. I think this leads to a TM, if I remember. Is it Psychic? Oh, it's a full restore. <laughs> Never mind! Alright. I'm pretty sure there is a place in... I'm pretty sure there is somewhere in, in, in this cave. I'm pretty sure there's a place that leads to uh, a Psychic TM. Like a Psychic move... Like, like not the Moo Psychic, but like a Psychic type. That's what I'm trying to say. That goes to the next room. Uh, I think I'm good here, okay. Alright. Moving on. Um, this... This leads to water, I'm pretty sure. I think it does. Again, it's been a while since I've done this. Sand Slash. No problem. No problem for Betty! Sand Slash is a really cool Pokemon. I've, the funny thing is, is I've, I've never actually used it before. Uh, which is kind of funny. It is a really neat Pokemon, but I've never actually used it on any of my teams. Okay. Um, I am not going to waste another Giga Drain. Uh, that will be one of the moves that I will use a PP up on, which I'm going to be doing at the end of this video. Uh, since I don't have anything to do now, really, after I'm done this, uh, all I really have to do is battle the Elite Four. So, yeah, my, so I'm going to be using the PP Ups and PP Maxes at the end of this video. Uh, my Rare Candies, I am not actually sure what I'm going to do with. Um, I still haven't really decided on that. I might use them on Mudstorm, but then Mudstorm is going to be, like... 10 level more than 10 levels higher than the rest of my team so I uh, know about 10 levels yeah so I don't really know uh, what to do with them um, but you know it's nice to have it's nice to have them I guess anyways and Tropius that's interesting let's go over to Emily actually you know what I could have went to my laptop but whatever All right, we're gonna go with Ice Beam. There we go. Yeah, I'm better than any trainer in the entire game. Anyways, yes, this does, yeah, okay, that was right, so it does lead to water. Uh, and you're gonna use another Repel. I'm just gonna go back and make sure I didn't miss anything. Um, okay. Betty needs to get up a level. That's what needs to happen. Betty needs to get up a level. Um, there is nothing here. Okay. Uh, just seeing if there's a hidden item I miss, and there isn't. Okay, moving on. So, got a place to surf here. Yeah, Victory Road and um, Ruby and Sapphire are pathetically easy. 
or not Ruby and Sapphire, Omega Ruby and Alpha Sapphire. It is pathetically easy. Like, it's so much shorter, and it's it's crazy. It's not, not even not even close to the same as, the, as this one is. Uh, over here, we got this dude who's got... Um, I'm pretty sure the, the trainer over here has got four Pokemon, if I remember correctly. Um... I'm almost certain he's got he's got a, an electrode. I know that. Uh, I don't really remember the rest. I know he has four Pokemon. He's got an electrode. Uh, Dodrio. Ooh. Oh well, that's bad for me. Okay. Gonna switch things over to Bolster. Try attack. Oh, wow. Hmm. Hmm. Another tri attack would probably knock me out. Let's go with a full restore. I only have one, actually, so let's not go with a full restore. Let's try a hyper potion. Hopefully, he doesn't use tri attack again. And he does! Wow. Dang. Okay. Oh, okay. Alright, let's, uh. Okay, hopefully that. Gets me into the red. Okay. All right, good. Beautiful. Awesome. Who's up next? Kadabra. Okay. We're gonna go over to my laptop. I could go over to Mudstorm for an easy kill, but my laptop needs to get some. My laptop needs to get to level 52, and so does Betty for that matter. Betty needs to get. You know what? I'm going with Overheat. Burn, baby, burn! All right. And there's that electrode I was talking about. I'm going over to Betty. Again, I could use Mudstorm for an easy one hit KO. However, Betty needs to get up a level just like uh, my laptop and Voltster do. And I am going with Sky Uppercut. And I can't believe they have not come out with a, with a fighting and electric type Pokemon yet. Or a, or a Dark and Electric. I can't believe they haven't done that yet. Like, man, oh man. Like, how, there's been seven generations, and they, I mean, those are, that's a, they can come up with a really easy Dark and Electric type. I mean, Luxray should have been Dark and Electric, and I just, I can't get over the fact that they haven't come out with, with one yet. Uh, hopefully they do for Gen 8. They've come out with some really interesting types over the years, like H Halucha, Fighting and Flying is a fantastic, I mean, I love Halucha. Halucha's a really cool Pokemon. Would have actually been a good idea for a character in Smash Bros. But, you know, I'm, I'm happy with, with Incineroar. And it's actually crazy how many starter Pokemon are are characters in Smash Bros. Like, you got Pikachu. I mean, technically Pikachu... I, I Technically, Pikachu is a starter. Um, I mean, in, in, in various games, like Yellow and Let's Go Pikachu, obviously. Um, and then you have Squirtle, Ivysaur, Charizard, Incineroar, and Greninja. So yeah, you have a lot of, um, a lot of starters that are playable characters. Anyways, will Betty ever get a level up? Like, holy macaroni. It's crazy, man. It's really crazy. Um, okay, we do have to go left, but I just want to make sure I'm not missing anything in the, over at the right. Um, oh, an Alexa. Okay, cool. Coolio! Alrighty. Um, so, now we want to go over here. Uh, there is a trainer down here that... Okay, th if I remember correctly, this girl has a Torkoal and a Skarmory? Don't know if I remember... Uh, okay, she has a Skarmory. I think she has a Torkoal, too. You know you've played a game... Yeah, you know that you've played a certain game a lot when you remember things that you shouldn't remember. Like, I really shouldn't be remembering... Well, what Pokemon do certain trainers have? But I do because that's how often I that's how often I played this game when I was younger. And that's a one hit K. Oh wow! Okay, holy smokes! 
That was lucky. I'm surprised that didn't knock me out. That's four times. That was four times effective. All right. Oh, it's not Torkoal. It's a Sableye. Okay. Uh, I will go over to Voltster. Even though Voltster's almost dead. Um, I'm going to heal up here. <clears throat> uh, and we're gonna go with a Thunderbolt. Oh, come on! No! <laughs> Don't do that! Okay, I gotta get rid of that paralysis. From that stupid it's from that stupid try attack okay please don't get par no don't go to the bag please don't get paralyzed man oh man Betty has been in the farmer party since I started victory road in the last video and she still has not gotten a level up it's it's actually annoyed me so much it is driving me crazy how she can't get a level up. You know, I might just... If my Repel's effect is almost done, I might just f find a wild Pokemon and just kill that for experience. Because it's seriously driving me nuts. Uh, I gotta get rid of that Paralysis on Volster. Um, cherry. No, I always do that! I have always, always done that. All the stinking time. Okay. Moving on. I mean, ooh, we got a double battle. Okay, well, I know exactly which two Pokemon I'm using here. Um, I'm going to waste a Hyper Potion here. Uh, no, don't go to your party! Okay. I'm going to use a Hyper Potion on Voltster. The Elite Among the Elite gather in this cave. How are you finding it? I'm finding it fantastic. I've come this far, but the tensions give me awful, awful stuff. Awful stomach pain. Maybe you should go see a doctor about that. Yeah, I know what awful stomach pain is like. I was stuck in a hospital um, in a different place, in a different province. I was on vacation, and I got, and I, yeah, I got these really severe stomach pains, and I was stuck in, the, in, the, in this random hospital that I didn't know for three days. And it was actually awful. And um, I haven't used Iron Tail yet, so I'll try give that a try. Um... But yeah, it was it was terrible. It was those were terrible. That was a terrible experience. And I'm glad it's over. I got a really nice pair of blue socks though when I left there, so that was nice. Finally! Finally! Oh my goodness! Finally! Level 52 for Betty! Oh my gosh! Okay, that was a bit of an exaggeration, but man, I'm so happy. Finally, I can use a different Pokemon. I feel like I've been using Betty. I feel like I've been overusing Betty the entire Let's Play. And what makes it worse is that um, she would be the ideal choice for the uh, for the first Elite Four member. Oh, come on! I don't know why I fell for that. Yeah, so I'll be using a PP Max on, on Giga Drain and uh, Dynamic Punch on, on Mudstorm. That's what I'm going to be doing because those... I mean, I don't really use Dynamic, pu dynamic punch, punch too much, but considering that it, like, m misses quite often, I think it would be a good idea. Or maybe not. Maybe I could use it on Blizzard instead. I don't know. Or Earthquake, actually. Because I use Earthquake a lot, so I don't know. Anyways, I'm definitely going to be using one on uh, Giga Drain for sure. I mean, if you're using a PP Max or a, just a PP up on one of your Pokemon's moves, I would recommend using it on a move that you use a lot. Uh, so maybe Dynamic Punch isn't a good idea because I don't really use it that often. Oh my gosh! Dude! Okay. Okay. 
All right, let's go with a Giga Drain on Clado and a Quick Attack on Lantern. Please don't heal. Okay, thank you. Thank you very much. Thank you very much for playing my game. That was a terrible impression. I am so sorry. Yeah, so Smash Bros. Ultimate. I'm really, really um, happy about the fact that the only characters that you start off with are the original eight that you start off with in, in Smash 64, which I think is really, really awesome because in Smash Wii U, there was only like three characters that you had to unlock in Smash Wii U. I mean, 3DS was a little more than that, but when Smash 3DS came out, I was like, wow, there's like no characters that they have to unlock. And then Smash Wii U came out and it was way worse. There was like only three. I mean, it's good to start off with a bunch of characters. You don't really have to do much, but it also makes it more fun. And you know, it, I don't know. It just makes it more interesting, I guess. Um, so yeah, and that's actually a good thing because the two character. Oh wow, okay. Um, okay, let's get rid of a uh, four star magnet. Uh, let's give that to. Oh, we could give it a bolster, but okay, I gotta get rid of that light ball. I really do. Um, is there anything I can get rid of? I don't really need the energy powder, actually. Hmm. Maybe I shouldn't be taking so long on this. Rival her hardstone. I don't really need the hardstone. I don't really want to toss my items though. Uh let's get rid of that um let's get rid of that energy powder. Okay, there we go. There we go! Problem solved. Uh, what was I saying? Yes, so I'm happy. I don't really, I'm not really too, uh, I'm, I'm actually pretty happy about the, about the characters that you start off with in Smash Bros. Ultimate being the original 8, because, uh, Kirby is my favorite Smash Bros. character to use in any Smash Bros. game, and Yoshi, I really like using Yoshi as well, so, I'm, you know, I'm pretty happy with that, pretty happy with, with those two being available from the start. Um... We're gonna go over to Mudstorm here. No! Crap, where is that gonna take me back all the way back? Yeah, that take me back all the way over here. Wow. Oh my gosh. See, that's why you gotta be careful not to do that. Where am I going? Am I going the wrong Where the frig am I going? I haven't been here yet, have I? No, I haven't, because I haven't battled this guy. Yeah, okay. You see, it's kind of hard when you can't see what you're doing. Kecleon. Okay. We got a Kecleon. Thank you! One hit! Substitute? I didn't even... I, I, I had forgotten the Substitute existed in this game. I thought it came out in Gen 4. Okay. It is back to a normal type, so we'll go with Thunderbolt. Graveler. Okay. Uh, let's go with Betty. Why not? I know I complain about using Betty so much, but I mean this. Then, then no, this way I don't have to use her in a in a fight later on. If that makes any sense at all. Uh, Bullet seed. Hopefully that does enough because it you are four times weak to it. Okay. Oh wow. Critical. Okay. Good. That's that's what I like to see. If you get one shot by one bullet seed, then you are a terrible, terrible traitor. Waylord. Okay. This is easy. Behold, the fattest whale in existence. Let's go with the thunder. And that was probably overkill. Look how s look how slow its HP was going down. That's kind of funny. All right, level fifty-two for Volt, sir. 4,032. Hmm. That's over 2,000 years. That's over 2,000 years away. 
Uh, moving on. Uh, I've been doing the amulet coin strategy the entire time I've been in this place, which is good, so hopefully I have lots of money. Um, when I get out of this place, I'm going to be doing some Elite Four preparations as well. So this video is going to be actually very long! No! Oh, I'm so tired of doing that! And that was probably the girliest scream ever, I'm so sorry. Okay, so that bridge, I'm pretty sure that bridge that we were about to go on leads to the other bridge. Um, okay, so don't go that down there. So this is, that's where we just were. Okay. Okay. Um, Repel's effect wore off. It's fine. Sorry for the lack of, of commentary. I'm trying to focus. I'm going backwards. <laughs> I'm going backwards. I'm going back the way I came from. Okay, let's be smart about this. Um. Okay. I know there's a I know there's a ladder um, that I always seem to miss, and considering that I can't like I know there is a ladder along here that I always seem to miss, so I want to make sure that I'm able to find it okay. Um, and since I can't really see what I'm doing that well, um, it's making it a little bit tougher. Uh... Oh, wait, yeah, I think I remember now. Um, yeah, there we go. Okay, that's the ladder I was looking for. Yes, I always I always miss that ladder. I, I mean, I've I've gone... I mean, I know from past um, from past playthroughs, I always forget what you're supposed to do. Is you're supposed to go up. Um, up the, the There's that one waterfall on the bottom. You're supposed to go up there and then come down another way or something. Uh, come down... Um, and the waterfall you come down on, you can't, you can't go up on because there's rocks blocking the way. So that is what my issue was, and I do that pretty much every time that I go through this place without using Flash. So that was not really a common mistake because I can never seem to completely remember what I'm that what I'm supposed to do. I eventually can figure it out, but anyways, I'm glad I'm glad that didn't take me too too long because I know a few times in the past I've I've gotten like really like stuck there. So yeah. And wow, this video is gonna be over a half an hour long. I'm so sorry. I really tried to, to go. I really tried to stop doing that. But whatever. Who cares? You guys are getting lots of content today, so that's fine. Maybe maybe this will be my longest video ever. Or not my longest video, but my longest video of the series. Because right now it's uh, that one that was 37 minutes. I don't exactly remember the part number. Right off. Uh, right off my hand. Oh, let's go with Iron Tail, sure. Yeah, Iron Tail's not a move I use very often in this game. But, thought it'd be a good idea to use it this time. Wonderful! Just wonderful! Okay, moving on. Um... 
Again, I'm being careful because I don't want to jump down any, go down any ledges. I'm just making. I want to make sure I'm not missing any items here. Uh, okay, this is what I was talking about. I knew there was a puzzle like this later on. This leads to a TM. I'm pretty sure. I could be wrong, but I think. Okay, I want to make sure. Oh, I didn't actually have to do anything. There. Oh, okay, that's. Hey, I can see! Yes! But unfortunately, I'm going back to not being able to see. Um, okay, so that doesn't actually lead to a TM. Okay, I want to make sure that I get... I want to make sure that I'm not missing anything. I'm just going to go back over this way. Um, we want to go... What way did we just come out of? Oh, I see now. We came out of... What the heck? Okay. Trainer that I missed. Oh, this is the girl with the torquil. I know he's got torquil in here somewhere. Okay. So, yeah, the reason why I did so little in the last video, because I wanted to make sure that, um, like, I wanted them to be even. I wanted, um, like, I didn't, I didn't want the last video to be longer. I didn't want to do too much from the last video. I didn't want the last video to be longer than this one. But, apparently, I did the opposite. Apparently, yeah, apparently I did the complete opposite. I, I didn't do enough in the last video. And, uh, no, 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 no. I did not mean to do that. <laughs> Crap. Anyways, I did the opposite. Now, this video is too long, and the last video was too short. Um, yeah, I actually did not mean to do that, so we're gonna go with that dynamic punch. And it misses, obviously, so that's not surprising. Absorb! Wait a second! Absorb?! <laughs> Whoa! Wait a second! You're using Absorb! Shouldn't you know at least Mega Pu- Or not, uh, Mega Drain by now? <laughs> wow. I mean, Ludicolo's face makes it goofy enough, but the fact that he used Absorb that makes it even that makes it even goofier. Dude, don't you have don't you have a, a TM for Giga Drain or something? Like, oh my gosh, that's hilarious! Absorb, wow, that is actually that's actually too funny. Oh, 54 for Mudstorm. And Metacham is up next, no problem. We're gonna go over to Emily. <clears throat> Let's go to Fly. Uh, did I do the amulet coin? I think I did. Yeah, I did. Uh, I'm really curious to see how much money we have. I'm not going to look until we're done with this place. But I'm really curious to see what our money total is. Because, um... Because I've used the amulet coin every single trainer. Um, how did I possibly go past that trainer without... Where am I? Hold on a second. I'm... This is not where I was before. I know that for a fact. I, w okay, I don't want to get lost. Where the flip... Where am I? Okay, I'm actually... Hold on a second. Crap, I was going the right way. I don't want to get... Guys, where... Okay. Okay, good. Okay, this is where I want to go. Okay. <sighs> okay. Okay. Um, you can tell it's been, you can tell it's been a while since I've been in here. Okay, now we're gonna go the right way. <laughs> That's only what the fourth time I've gotten lost in this video. Okay, I'm speeding this part up. This part's annoying. Okay, now with that, finally, I'm no longer blind. <laughs> I can see! Oh my gosh! Okay. Uh, th now, this means that you are very close to the end. When you're at this point here and you can actually see again, then you know that you are very close to the end. The first and the last rooms of the cave, uh, you don't need flash. Well, technically, you don't need flash in any rooms, but you know what I mean. And we got Cacturn. The cactus Pokemon. And guys, this might actually end up being my longest video of the series. That's a very strong possibility.
And I didn't actually realize that was gonna happen. I did not realize that this video was gonna be so much longer. I mean, I knew it would be longer, but I didn't think it'd be that much longer. But it doesn't really matter because I was planning on, on splitting that victory route into two videos anyway, so it doesn't really matter too much what the time difference is. And you're just gonna be one of these protect spammers, aren't you? Okay, good. Really, I really, really, really hate uh, when stupid uh, when stupid trainers just spam protect, and we're actually gonna be seeing a protect spammer in the elite four, which I'm really not looking forward to. But my dream ends here again. No, man, your dream ended the moment you were born. The moment you got out of the womb, that's when your dream ended. All right, guys, we got one final trainer up here. Well, actually, two more, because it is a, a double battle. Um, it is the last double battle. It is the last battle of the of Victory Row, which is nice. So now we know that we are really getting close to the end. Or, yeah, now we know we're pretty much at the end. Um, Vic, we'll use one on you, and let's go! I have nothing to say to anyone that's uh, that's come this far. Come on! What is the Victory Road? I'll tell you if you... Wait a second, you're asking me what is the Victory Road? If you don't know what Victory Road is, then what are you doing at the very end of it? And yeah, he says he's gonna tell me if I win. Well, we all know, that all, we all know that's not gonna happen, because every time they say, Oh, I'm gonna tell you this if you win, then they never do. So it's kind of a load of garbage, but... Okay, Sky... No, 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 no. Sky Uppercut, and... Screw it. Overheat. Oh my gosh. Oh, no, 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 no. Of course. You know what? Of course. Because all the other... Every time... Other, and any other Pokemon that y that uses Attract, that Pokemon that is using Attract tends to be a female. Because normally your Pokemon are going to be male. Because male is more popular on uh, quite a few different Pokemon. Especially starters. But no! The one time I have a female Pokemon, then the Pokemon that's using Attract has... Is a male. Of course. That always happens. That's always the way. I'll take that. You guys got a one-hit KO in the stomach. Big fat slacking. Gardevoir. Oh, yeah, because see, they use skill swap. <laughs> so Gardevoir's loafing around. That's funny. That's actually really, really funny. Okay. Let's go with... Bullet Seed, and Flamethrower, even though it's not going to do crap. And you're using a Full Restore. Wonderful. Absolutely wonderful. That's not doing anything. Oh my gosh. And guys, it's official. This video is the longest video of the series. Which I did not expect to happen. This video is pushing 40 minutes. Oh my gosh. I mean, my last... My last uh, part of... Um, my last part of... Uh, who wants to be a millionaire? Oh my goodness! Why? Why? Stop using protect! That was totally... That was totally not necessary. I'm so sorry. Uh, my last video of who wants to be a millionaire was nearly an hour. Um, which, again, it's not my... Okay, headbutt on you, and flamethrower on you, for Pete's sake. Um, that's, a, that's actually not my longest video. I'm pretty sure my longest video is the Jake the Happy Snake movie. Um, which is nearly two hours long. And now you have a slacking. Why? Okay, so this is not gonna knock it out. Um, oh my gosh! This is killing me. Yeah, this battle is actually this battle does take a while. I only, I would just hate for something bad to happen, like my computer like crashes or something. Because if that was to happen at this point, I would be so mad. <laughs> I I don't even think I'd be able to finish this. Please don't kill me, or you can kill me. That's totally fine. Okay, you know what? Screw it. We're going to Mudstorm for this. And that will kill Dusclops. No, it won't. Never mind. And they're uh, switching. They're swapping skills again. Okay. That's fine. That's fine. 
Okay, we're going with Earthquake. That's really... Or no, you know what? We're going to go with Dynamic Punch. That might be stupid, but please don't use a... Okay, thank you. Oh, no! <laughs> Crap. Oh, my goodness. I should have... I should have... No, I mean, it's 50% chance. Okay. Yeah, this video is over 40 minutes long now. That's... that. That's funny. Uh, Dynamic Punch and Flamethrower. Sure. Oh, it missed again! What? Are you kidding? Wow. I did not realize I used it, I'd used it that much. Here I am bragging about how I never used Dynamic Punch, and now I'm out of PP for it. Wow, I should have used Earthquake first, because I almost knocked him out. Okay, let's go over to um, uh, this guy and use Quick Attack. Shadow Ball. Oh my goodness. Okay, you're dead. Bye-bye, pal! Critical head. Okay, the sad thing is I actually might have needed that. Okay! We are done with Victory Road! No, you're a disgrace! Thank you. Okay, guys! Victory Road is complete! This is what happens when I'm recording for over 40 minutes. Okay, we are now at the other side of Evergrande City. And here we are at the Pokemon League! Yes! Oh my gosh! Okay. Holy crap, holy. Okay, guys. So, before I end off this video, I'm going to do some Elite Four preparations, which I probably don't need to do in this video because this video is already long enough as it is. So I'm just gonna go ahead and speed this up. We're gonna go ahead and stock up on items. First of all, how much money do I have? Uh, first of all, I'm gonna sell some items. Um, that I will get rid of. It's only 50. It's like nothing, but whatever. Um, Hearthstone, sure. Again, it's gonna be, yeah, it's only 50. Okay. Do I have anything that I can sell that's a lot of money? Moonstone, I can't sell, which sucks because I'm never gonna use it. I might as well just sell it, to be perfectly honest. I can sell all of these. That would be a waste. How much money do I have? Oh, okay. Um, okay. Uh, can I sell the light bulb? 50 polka dollars for the light bulb. It should be like 5,000. No, don't sell. Buy. Okay. Now, here's what I want to do. I want to buy. We're, we're going to want to make sure. We're going to go with 9, so I'll have 80. So that's good. So I still have lots of money. Uh, four stores. We're going to buy. be buying a lot of these. We're going to be buying 19 of these, so I have 20. Uh, full heals. I'm going to... I'm just blowing all my money, guys. I don't really need... Full heals. Screw it. We're buying 99. No, actually, no. We're not doing that. We're buying... Um... 93. There we go. Uh, revives... We're gonna buy 11. So I have uh, 50 revives, 100 full heals, 80 hyper potions, um, and I'm gonna spend the rest on two more full restores, which is probably not necessary, but I'm gonna do it because heck, you never really know. Um, and yeah, so there we go. Uh, this is a map of Hoenn, which I never ever, I don't think I've ever actually looked at that before. Um, I'm gonna end this video outside of this place. Um, and now for the PP Maxes and possibly rare candies. I don't really know if I'm, what I'm doing about the rare candies. Uh, I still don't really know. Uh, PP Maxes are all the way at the bottom here. Uh, I'm going to use one on Giga Drain. So there we go. And I'm gonna use the other one on, uh, Mudstorm's Earthquake. So there we go. Uh, PP Ups... Uh, this is really not that difficult of a decision. Uh, I don't really need to use them at all in Volster, any Volster's moves, because Volster's moves are pretty good. Uh, I'm gonna use one on, um, Dynamic Punch. I'm gonna actually use two on Dy Dy Dynamic Punch. I have four left. Uh, we're gonna use another one on, uh, I don't really think I need to use it on Overheat, actually. Um, we're gonna actually use on, um, Mudstorm Mudstorm's Blizzard. We've got three left. Let's use another one on Dynamic Punch. Sure. Um... Got two left. I just want to take a, take a closer look at my Pokemon's moves. Um, let's see, that's good. Um, maybe overheat. I think may, I can use one maybe on Ice Beam. Um, Volster is good, and maybe another one on Blizzard. Oh, what about um, Nightmare? 
Yeah, because let's go get Nightmare out of the PC. Um. Okay, Nightmare's gotta get it. Yeah, Nightmare's got some catching up to do. I don't. I think Nightmare's attacks are actually good. Uh, I'm pretty sure. Um. Yeah, Nightmare's good. So we have two left. So we might as well use one on. Um. What's his? Hold on. Excuse me, guys. Uh, for this, just for a second. So that, that, that okay. So let's go with um another one on Blizzard. And we have one left, so we're either gonna use it on. We'll go ahead and use it on um, overheat, I guess. So there we go. Okay, we are good to go. So guys, surprise! Uh, I'm not actually gonna be taking on the Elite Four on the next video. I'm the next video. I'm gonna have a nice relaxing video where I'm just going to be battling. I'm just gonna be training up my Pokemon. I'm gonna be playing some music and just training up my Pokemon. Um, I am gonna do, but I'm actually gonna do that on screen for once, just for a little special video. Um, so the next video, I'm actually just gonna be doing some 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 grinding, but the but after that, that is when I'm gonna be taking on the Elite Four, so you guys don't wanna miss that. So next time, I'm gonna be coming back here to Victory Road and battling some wild Pokemon and getting my, my, my main team up a few levels. So thank you guys very much for watching. I really, really appreciate it, and I will see you all next time. Peace!